Hello everybody, welcome to another Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing some Hot Pink. Now, I tried to record one other Let's Play of this, and it did not work. Um, I don't know why. So we're going to do this. Uh, this is a crazy high energy pedal game. I'm going to warn you, I'm probably going to get hyper. This game makes me seriously hyper. Let's just get right into it. Look at the colors, y'all. Uh, three reward tiers here. Spicy. Mild, cool, gain 7,000 points without losing the balls are cool, mild hit 12 bricks using a single ball without hitting without hitting the paddle, and spicy, destroy 6 bricks uh, in any, oh, destroy 5 bricks, no, 6, 6, 6 bricks in any explosion chain, good lord, maybe I need glasses, alright, are we ready, off to the races, y'all, boom, now, I just want to say, first of all, you will notice the gorgeous color work. Uh, it is impossible, impossible, not to get a little hyper during this, because I'm telling you, the music feels right, it's just snappy enough to suit the game without being overbearing or taking away from it. Uh, the multiple ball thing is a great thing that you've seen in other games that are pedal games, but it's done better here, I think because it's effortless and it feels just smooth. Um, you have a little buffer behind you here, and uh, I need to keep watching that better. I'm not watching it enough, frankly. See? Oh, God! And I just bit it right off the bat. Now, you will see here, oh, I hit the world ranking vermilion tier. Just behind Sir Wizardvich. We're, we're, we're trying to... It <laughs> says, please. Uh... It says different things. Last time it was like, one more try, now it's please. Uh, but you can see here, this is procedural as well. Procedurally generated. So every time you play this, did you guys see that save? That was John McEnroe worthy. Watch, John McEnroe is going to be like, fuck off, don't use my name. Um, but no, this is seriously... Holy cow, I feel so hyper. I got to cook after this, and I feel like I'm just going to be jumping around the kitchen, like, cooking, and, uh, my food is going to get done in record time, though. Guarantee that shit. Holy cow, this is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy energy, this game. Uh, yeah. When I first clicked on the name Hot Pink, I didn't know what to expect, frankly. I thought it was going to be a weird, quick story, or, like, uh, one of those, like, uh, JRPG love novels, or I had no idea, and instead I get Probably the best pedal game I've played since uh, Atari's Warlords, and if you're old enough to remember that game, then you will know how high that praise is. Um, don't get me wrong, Arknoid had its place, but without Pong, without Warlords, there'd be no Arknoid. Um, this feels like it takes Arknoid without the need for the capsule power up gimmick, and instead it puts a whole world of things, like, for example, you can't memorize the level with procedural each time, so therefore, you're getting something new. Ooh, see that? Did you see how impressive that looked? Uh, the co dude, the colors are just... That sounded, that sounded high though. Dude, the colors... But no, I mean, the color work here is incredible for a game that moves as fast and does not have lag or slow down. Uh, and I mean, yes, I'm on a decent gaming computer, but I'm sure I'm not on a beast like some of you have. And this still, look at how good it runs. Uh, and man, this music has just got me thinking of like Mystery Skulls, which is one of my favorites. Most balls reflected. Alright. Oh, Sir Wizardrich. Catching up on you, catching up on you. Don't give up, I am not. Uh, we're gonna do one or two more before this is over with, guys. I, uh... I, I can't help it, frankly. <laughs> it's, it's hard not to want to do. It is very hard not to want to play. Uh... Oh, boy. And I'm not gonna lie to you. Paddle games are not even normally my favorite genre, but this one is just that. The energy, man, it just... It gets you, and you just... You, you can't not want to play this. The saving thing there, that 
is clever. I love the little slowdown. Uh, some other things that I really dig about this game that I feel like give it some great replayability are the procedurally generated levels. Instead of, you know, let's talk Arknoid here. We all remember Arknoid. We all remember that it had certain round bosses and certain levels, and once you memorized where to aim, you couldn't get it dead on, but you could get a good facsimile of where you were aiming. This one, it's harder to do that with because you never know. You're just there to break the shit and enjoy the music and the, the beats just going and before you know it you're like yeah! and it's just it's there. It's they're just energy. Man, it just pumps you up a lot. Um alright, so what I think happens in this here, correct me if I'm wrong, if the dev or anybody sees this, is that you break the bricks, the bricks help strengthen your shield. Yeah, you you bite it enough like I just did, and you get uh, that, and uh, that is my overall score. I am slowly sinking down. This is the one I wish you all could have seen during that playthrough. It's gorgeous. Um, I did not get a chance to... <laughs> Unfortunately, I did it all, thought it was recording, and OBS decided it did not want to listen to record, so it did not record. Um, so yeah, thank you so much OBS for that. Um, and a lot of people have said, well, why don't you have a game capture card? Well, I will tell you why. We don't have that kind of YouTube money. In fact, we have no YouTube money coming to us. We are a uh, small channel, so we are not there yet. We are not Markiplier wealthy. We are not, uh, you know, we're not there yet. Eventually, there, there will be upgrades as we do. If you've noticed... We have upgraded the camera that we use significantly from the old one. Uh, so we have upgraded one thing. Uh, next will be the game capture card and a uh, mic. And then an entirely new PC completely. Uh, which will be one of my own design, which will be a monster for games. Uh, and feature some VR Let's Plays, hopefully. We are, if Vibe or anybody else wants to throw us a bone, we will kick the bone and run with it. Alright. So here we go. Doing much better this round. Man. This oof, oh, That was close right there, guys. That was close. And I know you guys are totally making fun of me, and I know I'm probably horrible with pedal games, and I, I am, I am horrible with pedal games. Um, I don't know what it is, I just, I freak out during them. I get like, ah, and then I just don't move the right, even if I see the right direction, I freeze up and I don't move in the right direction sometimes. I don't know what that is. Um, I suppose it's anxiety, but, uh... Why I would have it during a pedal game, I don't know. But yes, that is what happens to me. I, my brain says, hey dummy, move it this way, and I just don't. And I do not know why. Oh, that ball thought it was sneaking up under me there. Oh, sneaky deaky. Got two on the playing field. Two balls on the playing field. That almost sounds like the name of an adult film. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get in there with this. <laughs> Sounds like it. Name of an adult film. I feel like I could just keep that joke going. Alright, let's knock it off. Again, that's a. Alright, stop it. I'm allowed to do dad jokes, so I'm a dad. Longest game I just did. Ooh, look at the new bricks. So it keeps. Oh. Well, all right, I did something there, hey. Anyways, so guys, hot pink, great music, crazy visuals. Oh, I feel hyper. Uh, this game pumps you up, man. It's, it gets you like the adrenaline's crazy. Uh, if you dig paddle games, check out hot pink. I am Bones, thank you guys very much for chilling out with me and playing a few games of this, and uh, we'll see you on the next Let's Play. Thank you very much. You guys have a great day.